everybody, thanks for checking out my first ever YouTube guitar tutorial. If you like what you see and you'd like to schedule a lesson or get the rest of the tabs for this album, you can check out my Big Cartel page. It's cameronporus.bigcartel.com. And of course, please smash that like button. So today I'm going to be showing you uh, my favorite riff from one of my favorite songs to play live right now. It's the first riff from Blood of the Beggar. So the tune for this song is A, E, A, D, G, B, and E on a uh, seven string guitar. So the riff focuses a lot on rhythm and pauses, so try to remember that as you're playing it to really emphasize the rhythm and really hit those pauses cleanly, because that's really what makes the riff cool. So how we're gonna learn this, we're gonna break it down into seven parts and learn it piece by piece. So before we get into it, let's see what the riff looks like and sounds like at full speed. So remember the riff starts out dun dun da 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 dun da 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 dun. This is basically just a heavily palm muted uh, fourth interval starting at the eighth fret on the E string, and then you move down a single fret, strike it again, and that would be the seventh fret. So uh, two fourths in a row, eight to seven. Then you move into tripleted four note groupings. First on the open A string, and then another on the seventh fret of the E string. After that, it leads into da 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 dun. Da -da -da -da. So this is a quick little two finger part. It consists of four sixteenth notes and it goes into a similar tripleted four note grouping as before, but this time it's on the open A string and then the first fret on the E string. The next part is dun dun da -da 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 -da. and the fingering is similar to the beginning of the riff, but now it's moved down a string to the eighth fret on the A string and then down to the seventh fret also on the A string, making them both fit. Then there's another tripleted four note grouping. This time the first three notes are open A string and then the fourth note is the seventh fret on the A string, but instead it's held and bent instead of the pauses from earlier. From there, slide down to the second fret on the A string and do a triplet of four note grouping there and then into a quick pause. So now the riff goes and basically what that is is a four note grouping of sixteenth notes, which is four, three, two, and then five, and then another tripleted four note grouping, which is the open string of the A string, and then the first fret of the E string. So now the riff essentially just repeats, but the only difference is you do four sixteenth notes, which are eight open, seven open on the A string instead of the palm muted fourth. So now comes the bridge, which is the same palm muted fourth from before, and then it goes into a diminished chord at the tenth fret, and then into heavy palm muted power chords and more diminished chords, heavily palm muted as well. It goes eight, eight, seven, five, and fifth and then zero, zero, five, five, eight, eight, and diminished, and finally another eight, seven, and fifth. So the second bridge is very similar to the first one with most of the same notes and intervals, but a slightly different pattern. It's the same palm muted fourths from before and then into a diminished chord at the 10th fret, just the same, but this time it's held for a half note. Uh, when I play this, I usually do a little hand gesture at the quarter note mark. It just kind of like helps me stay on track for this part. And then it's uh, the same diminished chord set from before. This time, instead of hitting each note twice, you just hit it once. So it would be zero, five, eight, uh, all diminished, and then you just hold it out. So that's it for this tutorial guys, thank you guys for checking it out, and uh, if you like what you see, like I said, smash that like button, and I also got a new Big Cartel page, once again, that's uh, CameronPorus.BigCartel.com, and you can get a lesson from me personally over Skype, or you can pick up the tabs for this album, and I, you know, I might have other stuff out soon, so uh, keep a lookout, thank you guys for watching.